Hey guys, it's Jack Punkington, and today we're going to be doing a side-by-side -side here. The Orange TH30 versus the Joyo hey Bantamp Meteor, which is, of course, their orange clone. Um, now, I will, a couple caveats here. The Orange TH30 and the Orange OR30 or the Orange OR15 or any of the OR series are very different amps. Um, they're a two-channel versus a one-channel. However, the Meteor is kind of like a mix um, because it is a two-channel amp. Um, circuitry, I there's going to be differences. However, all of y'all have been asking for us, and I'm curious about this myself. Um, so we're going to see how this sounds. I'm going to be running it into this orange uh, Vintage 30 loaded 1x12 cab, and we're going to be using my Schecter Tempest here as my interface almost falls. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be starting off with doing um, cleans for each amp, and then I will do um, like a crunch with my MXR overdrive. After that, we're going to do kind of a mid-gain sound where I'm going to have the gain set kind of lower back, and then I'll ease my way into the gain, and then finally end with having my overdrive over top of the gain sound to kind of get like the high gain metal sound that I normally use when practice. Um, caveat. I do want to say this is a 30 watt tube head versus a 20 watt solid state head. Um, so just keep that in mind. Uh, if you care, they both have effects loops. I don't use effects loops. And yeah, so hope you all enjoy. Sorry for the weird mic. Uh, it's a very short cable, and it's very annoying. So enjoy. <laughs>
crunchy cleans into a nice just crunch sound to a mid gain and then high gain and then the tone I generally use at practice and with my music um, the orange TH30 versus the meteor band hit. my final verdict I feel like it doesn't get as saturated it still has the same general vibe um, as the TH30 but it doesn't get as saturated. However, I will say, in a circumstance where if I was playing and something happened to my amp and I had to swap out, I feel like with a little bit of adjusting, I could definitely do that. I might just have to dime the gain and kind of work with my MXR overdrive and get that tone, but it's really close. I feel like, honestly, it does a really good job um, between the two of them. Again, this is a TH30, not an OR30 or not an OR15, so it is a little bit of a different amp. Um, however, I think it does the job. So, um, Again, this is actually the last hoorah for my orange amp here. Um, so I've got something new kind of coming, hopefully, if everything works out. And I hope you all enjoy. So um, I hope this everything sounds good. Um, and as always, I hope you have a great day. Jack Plunkington signing out. Peace, everyone.